Kieran Tierney is our top priority because we need a new left back. What I'm going to do is I'm going to approach a loan for Timothy Fosu Mensa. I'm going to try and get him for two years at the club. Hello everyone and welcome to Season 3 of the Bournemouth Career Mode. We start off with a pre-season friendly and we have quite challenging teams as you can see right here. We have RB Leipzig, Leverkusen and Lazio in our group stage right there. It's very difficult for us but we're going to be getting into this with some sad news because most of the team is going to be departing the club. Um, let's see who's going to be departing. Diego Rico is going to be departing for 25 million. He'll be going to Sevilla, so hopefully he does well. We do have some uh, other youth players uh, coming back as well when I skip the next day. But Fosu Mets is going back to Man United. Williams is going back to Liverpool, and Lucas Nemeche is going back to Manchester City. So we have a few options for filling in that left back role since. Diego Rico will be departing. Uh, we will have a lot of money to come through into the bank when we skip into uh, the 2nd of January in the transfer window. There's one thing through the office, but I doubt, well, I imagine there's going to be a lot more. And also, some of my players left on a loan to buy. So, Jack Simpson, he's departed the club. He's uh, gone to. Uh, he's. It might pop up here, actually. I'm not sure if it will, but it, it said before I went into the uh, uh, the loading screen that he says he's going to be sticking with. <clears throat> oh, I'll get to that in a sec. But he said he was going to be um, sticking at uh, Lisbon. He'll be sticking there uh, for quite some time. So he went away for like two million, I think, which wasn't that much. Which wasn't that much. Uh, so yeah, uh, having a look here, we have some transfer offers here, and oh, okay. Funnily enough, I was actually tempted to get Kayan Hover, but I'm not gonna do a swap deal with Steve Cook. I'm sorry, but I will. I'm gonna go sky. <laughs> Christ, I can't speak today. <laughs> I've just eaten and my throat's all croaked up. I can't speak. But, oh, there is my money. There is my money. 70 odd million just from that. That is spectacular. Plus, um, oh, I didn't mean to go on that, but yeah, those are my players. Uh, I am going to go ahead and scout uh, Kayan Hover. But before I do that, um, why does it his name not. I, I'm probably losing my own. How do I say his name? Wait, who? Oh, uh, yes, there we go. Kayan Hover. I am going to scout this man because I'm potentially going to bring him in as my backup right back. And he's got a game face as well, which is good. Uh, let's have a look at the other. Uh, uh, Tyler Corner has departed. He's went to Peterborough. Coin goes out on loan. Rico departs. Player expiry, player expiry, player expiry. And looking at this. Uh, yeah, I've put some players on the uh, loan list. I'm going to actually show you this before I get into any games. I'm also going to go through and see if there's any free agents that I would pick up. So if I go over to... It's not search player. How do I do this again? Christ, I'm still stuck with this system. Right, transfer hub. If it loads, right, sent, received. Okay, this is it. Right, so blocked offers are for these three. I'm not going to be getting rid of them. Uh, but Jamie Hull and uh, Prop Probert, I think his name is, Kai Probert, they've both been put out on loan uh, because I believe they'll get to a nice potential. Um, so I'm going to look through the uh, free agents and I'll get right back to you. Right, so I have found... Uh, a few few players, um, not on the uh, free agents list, I couldn't find anyone, but I have found players that are, you know, youthful and I can bring in on the uh, free agents list that are not like, you know, an actual player, like an actual really good player. Say if like, I don't know, Messi was a free agent, I, I'm not going to get him, but still, just say if he was there, then he would be a contender, but no, I've only got youth players that are, have been shown up. Uh, but we are going to be simming games. Um, oh, Christ, I sh really should do this. 
before I go into the game, but normally I would just go ahead and sim these. In fact, that's probably what I'm going to do because I'm not going to be playing these games. Oh god, this is going to end badly. Okay, that's better than I expected, to be honest with you. Lazio next. There we go. Right, there's the loss. Um, <laughs> we're all the way at the bottom alongside Leverkusen. Okay, okay. Alright, we got a loan offer here and a transfer offer here from uh, Jack Stacey. A uh, loan to buy for PS PSV want him. I'm only going to do a loan because I I'm not wanting to get rid of him. I believe he's going to be like, you know, a backup goalkeeper for us because Begovic... Uh, well, actually, I I did pre-contracts, did I? I need to double check this because I think last episode, yeah, I, I gave Begovic a pre-contract and let's have a look at it. Yeah, have you given everyone a pre-contract? Okay, we're fine. We are fine. Uh, so we do move and Leipzig is the last game. Even if we do win this, um, which I don't even know. Uh, okay, Hull has agreed to go to PSV on a one-year loan deal, which is fantastic. Hopefully he gets up to a nice rating when he comes back for season four. Uh, but if we do end up winning this game, uh, then we will be playing the semi-final and the final. Like, uh, this is only... Yeah, it's a 2-2 it's a two -two draw. We had a pretty good game. Um, this episode is only going to be transfer-related. It's not going to be um, the likes of really anything that uh, amazing it's just transfers that are going to happen in this first episode then i'll be moving on to uh playing the first half of the um uh games we have in the premier league which actually i'll have a look right now so skipping all the way to the next month we have west ham and Crystal Palace as our first games that we're going to be playing for episode 2 and then episode, episode 3 we're going to be playing against Manchester United and Manchester City and then we'll stop on the 31st and then episode 4 um, I will not be... Uh, Christ, how can I put this? I'm going to record these immediately and then I'm going to stop on episode 4 because I've got my girlfriend coming round, I, um, you know, I just want to spend some time with her and it would leave enough time for you guys, if you're watching this, uh, to comment down below and suggest some transfer suggestions and y you never know, I could live stream the next one if I wanted to. Uh, there's more players coming through, there is this man right here, he looks okay, uh, but I'm not looking for goalkeepers, I'm not looking for anything like that, are you good? No you're not. Well, that man, I do have some players like him. He's going to be coming through soon, along with some others, which I'm currently waiting on. It won't take long, I imagine. Okay, we have, you know, our youth players coming back, and Hull has been moved uh, out on loan to PSV, which is good. And uh, Arsenal are interested to sign Calvert Lewin. That's interesting. Speaking of transfers like that, I am going to go straight into the transfer hub and I'm going to sign my first player. Who am I going to sign? I, I don't know. Uh, oh no, he's gone away to bloody Millwall, no. Okay, you look okay. He's alright, you know, I think I'll bring in him. You know, he's a good player to have and we have uh, Puig Martin... Well, yeah, Puig Marti. Puig Marti. He looks alright, doesn't he? I think so. Uh, but we'll wait for those. Um, has my thingy just been completely updated? I think so. Right, I'll get rid of Mark Rocker because I'm not interested in bringing him in. Uh, you, I'll get rid of. And, oh, Jesus Christ, it's switched over. Right, I'm going to do it this way just because it's much easier. Um, you, I am i don't know if I'll bring you in. There, there's a lot of players I'm not, not going to bring in in this because I, I can't sign everyone. But we'll start from the back. I'm not re... Well, actually, I am needing a right back. I'm needing to... You know what? I think I'm, I might go for Kyan Hover just as a backup because I'm not going to be replacing Stacey that easily. So... He's an option, or I can go for this man right here, but I'm most likely going to go for Kayan Hover, who I believe is an absolute unit. Uh, for the left-back spot, Kieran Tierney. He's on my mind. He is on my mind, and I would not mind bringing him in. Uh, Teo Hernandez, 
I can only dream of having him. But Donnarumma, no, well, Donnarumma, I'll bring in. Okay, I'll bring him in. But Kieran Tierney is our top priority because we need a new left back. And the number 41 for Olympic Marseille is going to come straight back to the Premier League. Oh, boy. 45. That's it. No. I won't budge. I will not budge. 10% plus 45. Take it or leave it. Yes! Thank you, Marseille. Thank you very much. That is an absolute bargain right there. 45 million plus 10% sell on clause. That's good for Keaton Tierney. Because he's an absolute beast. If I do that and that. Shake my hand. Oh, go away. Your mind, no, your agent is an absolute dick. <laughs> your agent is a dick. Okay, you know what? I'll do that. Okay, they've. I'll accept it. I'll accept it. They've they've decreased the price of the um, signing on bonus, but that is our first player we have brung through. Let's see the confirmation. What number does he have? Number two. Kieran Tierney with the number two. Welcome to Bournemouth. Uh, right, next player. Who am I going to bring in? Uh, these, I'm just going to wait out. I don't know if I'm going to sign these. Yeah, I, I, yeah, again, I said my voice is going. Um, but who am I going to bring in? Uh, right back, that's right footed, that makes more sense. Or I can bring him in and switch him to a right back. It's one of the two. I mean, he's someone, you know, different. And to be honest, I'm kind of preferring this lad because I, a left wing back that's right footed, just, I don't know. I, I don't think that's right. So... I can make him our backup right back? No, actually no. I'll make him a right back. I will make Domino Ruma a right back. Let's have a look at his stats. Ooh, that's actually really good. That's really good. So we'll have him as our backup right back. Problem sor sorted. I mean, I'm going to delegate. Um, so put him on a wage that and that and he'll negotiate over the coming days so I'll leave that he might be our uh, next signing uh, I'm gonna bring you in as well because I think you are decent so we'll lower this down to seven and a half thousand pounds and don't go higher than ten yes I think that's the plan and we have money left over I want him to bring him back but I think I want more players to bring in. Uh, Marcus Edwards, I'm not really going to bring him in. Uh, El Nezri, maybe. That's only if I'm needing, you know. So Nathan Ake, he's a he's a player I want to bring in actually. Or Matteo Genduzzi. Oh, there's players that I want to bring in. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to approach a loan for Timothy Fosu Mensa. I'm going to try and get him for two years at the club and see what they say. He's someone I really want to bring in. So I'm gonna ask for basic terms. And, oh, it's only a year. You know what, a year will do. A year will do. He's not He's not running out of uh, his contract, which is good, and we'll pay 40 grand for his stay. Will he come back? I do not know, but he's someone to have uh, just in case. And the other situation is centre-back. I really want to bring in RK, but I think I'm going to wait because I think we've done enough transfer business as it is. And if an offer does come in for like... Well, I mean, Mepham already had an offer come in, but it's just in case. But I mean, we'll stop on the... Uh, yeah, we're going to stop on the first uh, so I can then, you know, get my scouts back. Well, get scouts organized and then that'll be me. I will play the rest of the season and that is where I am going to end it.
Yes, Timothy Fosu Mensa has been loaned back in, which is fantastic. And we have players accepting to join. What role are you, Sporadic? I mean, yeah, 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 that's fine, that's fine. So we have Donnarumma coming in, and we also have Puig Marti coming in as well, which is fantastic. What number does uh, Fosu Mensa get? Does he get nice? No, I want him to get his number 18 back. So he gets the number 18 back. And we are going to change Donnarumma's number to 20 since he's back up. Uh, so 21? Yeah, we'll give him 21. Why not? And we are going to go to development plan and we're going to switch him to a right back because he's right footed and he would prefer that position there. So here we are, right back. Simeon and Donnarumma, welcome. And we have uh, a new CDM coming in as well. Uh, we're going to give him a 30 it's just because he's a prospect. So 34 is not taken, so I'll, I'll take that any day of the week. Development plan for him. Is there anything there that we would do? It's, yes, yeah, defending. It's, ver it's very much likely going to be defending. So ball winning. Uh, thing my bobber I don't know <laughs> what it is uh, but yeah I don't need to improve his pace his pace is you know fantastic the way it is and yeah that's pretty much it I mean the team's looking better and better you know as we you know continue it, we've brung in some players that I've wanted to bring back uh, we'll put you there and then on the bench you go Donnarumma is going to be our newest right back so I was thinking uh, Kyan Hover, but uh, Jesus Christ, I was thinking Kyan Hover, but nah. But we're doing fine. The depth is getting very much better. I am very happy with that. Uh, Lloyd Kelly's the backup left back, so we don't need someone there. Um, I have been thinking of getting rid of Jefferson Lerma and bringing in Genduzi, hence why he's on my shortlist, but we shall see. And uh, maybe um, I'll give Cook a new contract just to say he's, you know, he's not going to be our, you know, backup. He'll be like fourth choice. <laughs> uh, I can't believe I'm saying that, fourth choice, but hey ho. And maybe a striker, I'm not sure, but that's all I have planned. An offer has come back for Steve Cook. People are trying to sign him. <sighs> okay, I, I did it. I, I was tempted just to keep him, but I need to improve the team. I really need to improve the team. It's a shame that he's going. I really didn't want to do it, but I did it. So he might go to Ajax. I'm not sure. But we are about to find out in the next couple of days. Right, we're going to stop on the first, like I said. I'm just going to sim it because I don't trust the simulation system in this. So, stop in there. Perf perfect, perfect, perfect. Youth Academy reports. We don't really have that many people in there at the moment. Um, Morrison, I am going to bring in actually because you know he's someone that de deserves to get some action and we've got Akuna at the right back uh, I'm gonna bring him in also and I'm gonna put them both onto the uh, the loan list because they need to get some football action in their lives so Morrison if you could very kindly go on to the uh, list right there. I'm going to change his number because, yeah, again, he's a prospect. I always do this with like every other player. And the right back, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Akuna. We're going to do this with the same. Change the number. Just in case he doesn't go, I change the numbers immediately. So 38 he's going to get. And we're going to put him on the loan list. I might fix some have I already fixed some of the numbers yes I have I've already fixed most of the numbers I'm probably gonna give new players contracts but that is the team coming into the season actually one thing I do need to check is that who came up because I didn't do that I didn't show you that okay right so Sheffield United came up uh, Brighton came up I saw that and who else? Aston Villa came up as well. Okay, so this is pretty much the Premier League as it was. <laughs> oh my days! This is yeah. This is the exact same. 
Okay, right. It's the exact same as, you know, the season that uh, Bournemouth got relegated. But anyways, one more thing actually. I'm just going to check see what the latest deals are so far. Ansu Fati has gone to Bayern Munich. I don't know what his rating is, but I imagine he's at like the 85 rated, somewhere like that. Um, Diaby. Uh, he's gone to Atletico Madrid, Suchek, that's a player we don't have to worry about for West Ham, he's gone away to Inter, Soler has gone away to West Ham after getting them promoted, well getting Aston Villa promoted, Calvert-Lewin did go to Arsenal, Grealish has gone to Everton, very interesting. He stayed with them. Uh, Sanchez is... Go oh, that's a bit controversial because he's a Spurs player. Uh, yeah, I've, I wasn't going to get him. He was on my uh, shortlist. Keaton Tierney, the boy. He is here. He is here. Oh, uh, yes. That's one uh, less player that we need to worry about because Kieran Tierney is going to be a beast, especially with his stats. Look at it. Look at it. Actually, I'm going to give him a I'm going to give him a training drill just so he can boost up his rating. So fish bash bosh. We're doing well so far. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's uh, all we have time for today. Uh, if you did enjoy, then please uh, hit that subscribe button and leave a comment uh, if you have any suggestions on who to bring in. Uh, I'm needing a defense defensive drill on him. So this one or is it that one? It's going to be this one. So we're going to do that. And that'll take him 17 weeks to become an 83. And we probably don't have that much uh, time left for Simeone Donnarumma. He has one week to become a right back. So perfect. We're fine. <laughs> so, yeah, again, thank you very much for watching. Season 3 has begun. And I shall see you in the next episode. Take care.